Yo, okay, let's talk about why you are stuck, right? Why you're stuck struggling to lose weight, going round and round in circles, trying the same old things over and over again and never ever getting anywhere, right? What is the reason? Why do you do that? Comfort, my friend, all right? Comfort. Comfort is the killer of dreams. So right now you're stuck in a comfort zone. You're doing the things that you know how to do because they're comfortable, they're easy, right? Change is difficult. We human folks don't like change. We just don't, all right? We like to do things that are easy for us. We always look for an easy way out. It's just what we do. We go through our whole lives looking for, for a way to make everything more efficient. It's just how the human body is, all right? But when you get stuck in that comfortable mentality, so, you know, you wake up at an exact certain time in the morning, you travel to your work, you come home from your work, you sit on the couch, you maybe play with the kids. It's the same routine pretty much over and over. So to make a change and to do something different is difficult. It's difficult because you don't want to change because you're happy in your little cocoon, all right? And I'm not just saying this because that's what I, I think about you. I'm saying that because that's how I was for the longest time, all right? I was stuck doing the same thing over and over and over again, and it was getting me nowhere, all right? I was feeling down. I was depressed. I was overweight. Everything I tried didn't work, all right? You've got to break free from your comfort if you want to move yourself forward. That's how you're, that is how you're going to see a sustainable weight loss. You need to do something that you've not done before. Right? So if you're constantly looking for that quick fix, that secret potion on the internet that's going to help you magically lose 30 pounds, it doesn't exist. All right? Yeah, okay, you're going to lose weight in the short term, 100%. But then as soon as you start actually eating food again, because you're going to start craving food and wanting to eat food, because if you've been told that you can't eat a certain food, what happens? You want to eat it. You want to eat it more. All right. That inner child goes, oh man, you've told me I can't have that. I bloody well want it. That's what happens. All right. That inner child takes over and we all have that. So when you start eating real food or you start introducing the things that you've told yourself you can't have, all of a sudden you balloon all this weight back on and think, oh, well, that diet was crap. It didn't get me anywhere. Oh man, that's just another one that I've failed. And every time, every time you stack up those failures, you start to then believe that you are a failure and that you can't succeed, all right? You can't afford to go through your life like that. You need to make a change. You need to do something different. You need to break that mold and step out of your comfort zone, all right? So <clears throat> what you need to do is something different. If right now you're waking up at seven o'clock in the morning and you're getting ready for your work and going away off to work and then you're saying that you don't have time to do any exercise, Get up a little bit earlier in the morning. It's horrible, it's hard, it's difficult. If you've been used to doing a thing for a certain way for a long time, it's going to be tough. But the easy way to break free of your comfort zone is to start doing things that are difficult, things that you don't want to do. Right? So whether that's having a cold shower in the morning, right? don't try and do it all at once, because if you try and do it all at once, you'll, you'll just fall flat on your ass. Right? You don't want that. So do something, pick one thing that you can do that's difficult, that you do not want to do. The thing you've got the most resistance against doing. And that's the thing you need to do. You need to attack it head on. Right, so if it's getting up at six in the morning or five in the morning so you can do a workout, get up at five in the morning. Practice that for a week before you start committing to the workouts. Just practice getting up at five and then just getting on with some stuff around about the house. See how it feels, but make yourself do it. Don't give in. Don't hit snooze. Make yourself do it. If it's the thing you don't want to do, that's what's going to move you forward. All right? If that means you've got to go to your bed half an hour earlier, an hour earlier, so be it, my friend. All right? But that's what you have to do because... If you get stuck in your comfort zone and you stay in your comfort zone for a long period of time, the longer you stay there, the more difficult it is to break free, all right? And if you want to move yourself forward, if you actually want to start seeing some long-term results, then you're going to have to do something different, all right? Now, I can help you 100%. I can help you get where you need to be, whether that be through one of my coaching programs or whether that be through some free resources that I have available, I can definitely help you. So what I want you to do is send me a message right now and let me know where you've been struggling, what has been difficult for you over the last however many years that you've been struggling to lose weight, all right? Let me know what's been a struggle, and then we'll put something in place that actually is going to work and move you towards your goals, all right? Because if you don't take action and don't make this decision to actually change and improve your life, you're going to continually go around on that hamster wheel and not get anywhere, all right? And then you're going to feel depressed, you're going to feel like nothing ever works, you're going to feel like you're a failure, and you're not a failure. You can lose weight and I can definitely help you do that. All right, so send me a message right now. Let me know what you're struggling with. Let me know what your goals are. 
we can put a plan in place to start moving you towards those goals. We're not going to focus on the goals, we're going to focus on the progress, the process. What, what steps you need to take every single day to start building habits into your life to move you closer to your goals. So you actually start seeing results that you can maintain for the long term, all right? Get in touch now, send me that message. No more comfort, no more procrastinating. Don't put this off any longer. Your life and your health is too damn important and I want to help you move forward in your life, all right? So have yourself an awesome day. I hope you found this useful. If you did find it useful, ping me a message down below. Let's get in touch. Let's have a, let's have a chat and let's see what I can do to help you, all right? Take care. I'll speak to you soon.